Hi, I'm Matt Kennedy, and we're standing in Gallery 30 South in Pasadena. As you can see, my wife is here as well. She's the co-owner of the gallery. Uh, gallery 30 South is an atelier space for the Ad Novia line of insomnia jewelry, as well as an exhibition space that I program uh, in Congress with my other gallery director duties at La Luz de Jesus Gallery. What's great about this show is that this represents a graphic novel on gallery walls, and it's hung in order so it tells one narrative story and it was originally supposed to be an adaptation of musician Nick Cave of Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds um, and Birthday Party and Boys Next Door. Uh, his first novel which was called And the Ass Saw the Angel and Tom was approached to adapt this as a graphic novel. Spent about a year working on style and figuring out um, what the voice was going to be in presenting this uh, complicated novel which is somewhat in the same vein as, say, William Borrow's The Naked Lunch. And that's right here we're standing in front of some of the pages from The Blot by Tom Neely. And this is the 10th anniversary of his releasing this. He self-published it. It won the Ignatz Award. It was an early victory for him, which I think emboldened him to be able to think, hey, I can do this for a living. And he's been relatively successful since. He's done quite well. But what's great about sequential art is that Every page is a representation. Each individual page is a representation of the entire thing. And even something like this, which is a self-contained story, this is a graphic novel that exists only between the pages of that single graphic novel. It wasn't serialized in individual issues that were released over time. It did not have a sequel. So what you're looking at is a few select pages from this one thing. So contextually, as a work, it is one work. But when you look at this, if you are not familiar with the rest of these pieces, it doesn't have the context of the things that are around it. You just see this character that is illustrated in a very kind of...